Hi baby loves and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Tatiana Doñas. So for today's video, I decided to film the long awaited Q&A. So those of you who have me on social media, on Snapchat, on Instagram, um, I posted for you guys to ask me questions that you guys want me to answer um, about myself and what you guys want to know about me. And I got a pretty good amount. Um, I actually only pulled a some questions. So if you guys wanna see a second part to the Q&A, just let me know and I'll pull out some more questions. Um, but I did get a generous amount of questions that I am so excited to answer for you guys today. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into it. I have all of my questions on my old phone, so I'm gonna go ahead and be reading them off this raggedy ass phone. Okay, going into the first question, um, how did you get into makeup? Uh, so I started watching Bethany Moda, Mac Barbie 07 here on YouTube when I was about 12 or 13 and then I used to be like so into how she did her makeup, like her mascara and her eyebrows, her lipstick and stuff like that. So I actually really started getting into little makeup here and there with um, watching her videos. It wasn't until a little after that I started getting into eyeshadows. Next question, what is your current favorite foundation? My current favorite foundation would have to be the Maybelline um, Matte Fit Me Foundation. How old are you? I am 19 years old. I just turned 19 in January. Where are you from? Uh, I am Mexican and I am really in love with my culture. Y si hablo español, for those of you who are asking. Um, so yeah. Next question. What is your favorite makeup brand? Um, at the moment, actually, I'm not even at the moment. It's literally been all day, every day, Anastasia Beverly Hills. I love that brand so, so, so much. So yes, definitely my favorite brand. It definitely intertwines with the last question that was kind of similar to this one. How old were you when you started getting into makeup? I was 13, but I didn't start getting into like eyeshadows and full face till my junior year of high school. So that was in 2015. What are your plans for the future? Oof. Ooh, that question scares me. I don't really, okay, so this is gonna sound bad, but I don't really have a plan. I'm kind of just like, I'm working for the best. I wanna be successful. I really, really hope to be successful continuously, just love what I do and just grow in what I love. That makes sense. Next question, favorite color. I have two, well, I had one, but then like recently it's been two. Um, Tiffany blue and blush pink. I love blush pink so, so, so much. Like you guys will never catch me, not in blush pink, anything. My favorite brand of lipsticks. Ooh, this is a hard one. Um, I would have to say for lipsticks, either um, Dose of Colors or Anastasia Beverly Hills. Those have to be my top two brands for um, lipsticks. Cats or dogs? Dogs. I love dogs. I actually have my Chihuahua sleeping right here. I don't wanna wake her up, but she's sleeping right there. <laughs> favorite palette. Mm. I don't really have a favorite palette. It's mostly just like I like various palettes, but I just like like one at a certain amount of time. But right now I've really been um, into the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette. I love that palette. I'm actually wearing that palette on my eyes right now for this cut crease. So um, I love that palette. It just has so much like neutral, but then it has like pops of like shimmer and like, color, like the turquoise and the purple. And I'm just like, <sighs> I love it. <laughs> Next question, favorite highlight. Currently, my favorite highlight has to be the Anastasia Beverly Hills Omrezy highlight. I'm wearing it right now. It's so cute, so gorgeous. Like, ooh, ooh, yes, work it, go. Next question, how do you spend your free time? I don't really have free time. I work um, throughout the week, so I have the weekends off, so I guess if I'm not reading or like thinking about YouTube videos to film. I'm probably just eating, like, or at the gym. Yeah, at the gym. Final question, what's one fun fact about you? Ooh, I don't know, I'm not a very interesting person. Um, oh, okay, so this is not a fun fact, but it's kind of just like, well, I don't know, it falls, I guess it falls under that category. So when I was in fifth grade, I was running late for school and my grandparents um, used to live across the street from me, or actually let me reword that. I used to live across the street from my grandparents. So they used to take um, me and my siblings to school or me and my sister because the other ones weren't in school yet. But um, 
they used to take us to school and so we were running late one morning and I was laying on the couch and he was like let's go get up let's go so I went to the car and then um, I was feeling sick that morning so I was sitting in the car he's like are you sure you want to go and I was like no can I just call my mom so I called my mom from the house but I ended up like getting out of the car because I made everybody else late so everybody else in the car was running late so I got out of the car and he started driving off and I hadn't even closed the door yet so I was like wait so he stopped and when he braked like I like slammed the door but it's like I slammed it on my finger so like this pointed finger right here um it got so purple and so fat I literally started crying like I didn't even care that I was sick it got purple like throughout the day and my dad got home and it was like literally it was like so fat like it was it was abnormally fat and it was purple so it was like the nail was bruised everything just looked gross so my dad um ended up sterilizing a needle and like poking like a hole in my nail because obviously my nail wasn't like gonna survive like it was all purple I had to puncture my nail to get all the blood out of my finger lost my fingernail that's that it grew back within like two weeks i think so that wasn't really like a fun fact it was more of like a little story time but um yep but that concludes all of the questions. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this little mini get to know me. If you want to see a part two, go ahead and just let me know down below in the comments. Also, give this video a huge thumbs up. And don't forget to click the bell icon so you'll be notified every time I upload a video. With that being said, thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you guys later.